well, now it is. So we've had, we think, a pack rat. We're going to find out. Over here, we're cleaning up our winter mess. Big old mess underneath it. Sure, we don't it. find is what we're sure, really hoping. We got all of our stuff here for our scarecrow. Got some rope. I'm gonna plant some onion, I think, in these big totes. And I'll videotape. You guys can tell me what you think. We got a bunch of stuff we gotta get rid of. Nicklin's out here giving the cow some water, her and Trinity. They're having a nice conversation. We had the trampoline turned upside down so it wouldn't get blown away, but it's all right now. There's our chicken coop from here. And our goats and our dogs. We get to clean all this up now. Yes, that's a pack rat the size of my cat. Yeah, they are. They're big. And he had one run up his leg. Have you heard that story? Yeah, I did. I thought I needed to go back. I need to say picture. Anyway. To the turds. Yeah, everybody on YouTube is going to get to watch the turds now too. I want to Google it and see what one looks like. She's coming back up here to get the water turned off. <laughs> She's like, really? Watching me all the way. She's moving. Trinity is moving, it sounds like.
go. Almost. Oh, you can see his little eye and his little head. Isn't it cute? Look at his little wing. He's going to come out his next push. He's going to come right on out. Oh, looky there. There he is. His goodness. Hard to come to this life. We got another one coming out, ladies. Oh, no, Alina, are you going to bed? Yeah. Come here and looky here. We got a, a chick hatching. He's coming out of the shell. Oh, he just came out of the shell. Listen to them all welcome him. Okay guys, so today we're going to take our chickens, our baby chicks, out of the incubator that we have. All right, so guys, these are our chicks. We're going to move them. We're gonna take the really ones that look really ready to go and fluffy and dry. We're gonna take them with us to the basement, to their new home. How many you got, Nick? Three. All right. So we'll set this up. How many you got? I got three. All right, I'm just going to... Now I have four. All right, so bear with us for a minute. And we'll... Did I get anybody over there? Are we good? No, mine is chirping. Okay. She's got one in her hand, chirp, 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 chirping. Okay, we got this one. Come on. So we're going to take them to the basement. Excuse my mess. Now we're in the basement. So that was those. You can pull this one across, if you pull this in the middle. If we, okay, so we made it where we can do half and half. So now you're going to make your chick drink some water so they know there's water there. Ooh. So all the chicks have to taste the water so that they know they have water. Food. Food. She's doing food, but I always just do water. Drink. I just put your face in there. You just put their drink in there. All right. Whoop. So she's going to do the same. Sometimes that cactus can be like, you need it, you missed one of them. Yeah. <laughs> I hope not. Look at their face. That one's big. Boy, that metal's hot. That's really hot. So Brandy, like, well. All right, so we it's have. Go in. Get in there. there All right. Go. Now everybody knows where the water is. Alright, so then. There's already a lot more than my last one. I like how they're all white too. It's like Grandma's Grandpa did this intentionally. Oh, yeah? Okay, I'm gonna need more. Alright, so now we're gonna go get more. Alright, guys. So we've moved our chicks. We moved the rest of them in here. Sorry, I have to keep it at one angle. So there's about 19 birds in here now. Got some over here eating. We have a simple setup. We have a black chick over here. I'll show you that too. So we do have a couple more birds upstairs in the incubator that haven't got to come down yet. So I wanted to show you our setup. We have some totes. And this is what we keep our chicks in. We just put them in a Rubbermaid tote. And we have an old closet rack we put over the top of them. And then they get their feeder and water and they'll stay in this tote until they get to be big enough for us to move them. These are the birds we hatched last week that was on the YouTube video. 